Welcome back, guys. My name is Eli the Magic Dragon, and this is Banjo Kazooie on the 360. Let's say that right now. So, the Nintendo, you don't claim crap. This is an Nintendo. Yeah, they can't either. They can't anyway. Anyway, I see a, I see a jiggy. Hey, last we left off, I was just below 50 notes. I collected all the ones on the hillside, and then I just kind of continued moving on. So I didn't do anything ma major. I just kind of started collecting music notes and stuff. If I'm going to show every little thing, then I will, but, you know, I figured, like, hey, you guys, are, you guys will get it if I cut out, like, oh, I collected the music notes on this hill, then you'll get it. And you'll understand, like, yeah, yeah, he just went on the slopes, he got it. So I'm going to get to save that jiggy for a sec. Let's get these. And one more jiggy for the road, baby. Okay, that makes five. Alrighty. Excuse me? Who's making that noise? Whoa, what are you? Ah! There we go. Oh, I need to learn the thing. Damn it. Okay, we got two of the three moves. This is number three. This has to be the ground pound. I call this the Beak Buster. Jump into the air, then press the right or left trigger to send Kazooie slamming hard down on the floor. Cult, I don't like the sound of that, Banjo. Get used to it, Nest Girl. You'll be using it a lot. <laughs> Whoa, Banjo, there's nothing more I can teach you on this world. Oh, good. I don't have to hear that voice anymore. I gotta hear that voice a lot. That's for to clear the air. I say I make it sound high. I don't know what that actually legitly feels like. Never done drugs, and I don't condone it. So I don't support it. You know, I do not condone the use of any, you know, enhancements of any kind. Yeah. I don't condone the sin of gluttony. That's what I should say. Oh, you son of a! Remember, kids. Too good of anything is bad for you. I mean that actually. Too good of anything. Too much of the water can kill you. The thing that is the key to life can kill you. Too much of the thing of life. Hey, Jinjo! And break this house. Oh, cool. A life. I need to get one of those. Damn it. Oh, there's a jiggy in his eye. And I got another jiggy just now. Oh, I'm just scoring these left and right. Look at this. Yeah, break this house, you get it. There's one more in the eye. I'm, I'm like trying to be informative, but at the same time, I'm having way too much fun to just be completely straight faced informative like a lot of other play Let's Players and playthroughs and whatnot. So I'm just kind of like. I consider myself more entertaining YouTuber. I don't make this stuff just to be informative. I want to entertain first. My first priority is always to entertain. We Juju Mumbo's totem poles. Feed us with nice blue stones. Blue stones? You mean like what I look like after I see um Kim Kardashian? My stones turn really blue. Yeah! Battle 10? Battle 10? Did I get all of them? Oh no, I gotta get the ant tail. It's almost all 10. How do you check the progress? Oh, view total. All right, let me look real quick. Yup. Oh, I gotta, I gotta find two more honeycomb pieces. All right. We're getting there. Where's that damn honeycomb piece? Damn it. Fine. Ah, oh, snap. Me, Mumbo, best shaman in all game. Can help Banjo with filthy feathered and filthy feathered ones. Watch it, hut boy. Mumbo's magic tokens hid by which find tokens and Mumbo help you. Banjo not got enough tokens for Mumbo magic. Look at Sai. Bring more. Fine, stingy. Oh, shiz. Shiza. No, I don't want to fall down anymore. I don't want to fall down anymore. This is stupid. This is some stupid crap. There we go. 
Wait, does that? No, that doesn't count. That's, that's Gruntilda's lair part. Because the one I know is inside the mountain. Where's this dang token at? Dumb and dumb fuckery. Hey, ugly, no bears allowed in the ticker's tower. Speak faster, baby. I can't hear you when you talk that slow. Yes, eekabokam, okabo. Eekabokam, 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 uh-oh. There's a honey piece up here. We're just gonna have to go in and come back. I'm not sure to do that. There we go. Alright, so that was long. Ah, Banjo has plenty tokens. Stand on score. And press X to see Mighty Mumbo Magic. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Hey, what the hell you turned me into? What is this? Mumbo Magic free to change back. You come when ready. Termite bite strong, but not bad for first spell. Mumbo practice needed. Hey, dang straight, look at me. Useless. Look at me! I'm so tiny and insignificantly stoop! Oh, I can go get that. Termites have better grips on the walls than a uh, freaking Kazooie, as demonstrated. I can get this! I just got one left. I have no idea how I'm gonna get it. I gotta come back in. No, I'll cut out. I'll cut it out. There's a climb the tower of Ticker. That's what they call themselves. The termites. Oh shit. Aw, oh, come on. Alright. If I keep falling off this, just future me, just, you know, you know what to do. Dang it! Why do I keep falling? I just can't get a grip on this wall and I can't see because the camera just zooms out a little too far for me. And I got it. There we go. That's better. Eee. Hey, why did you get those shorts? I want them too. You found all 100 notes on this world. Well done. I like bottles. That's why I give them. If I give a character an affectionate voice, if I can think of one, then it means I like them. Just, 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 just. Give me that cold backpack or else. I bet you eat my butt. How about that? You eat one. <gasps> an extra life. I got an extra man. In this case, bear. Well, can I, can I, like, make it from here? Oh, cool! That was the last one. Ah, uh, see, I'm not gonna make it. I don't have the bird. I've competed this level. I'm gonna go out there as an ant. Termite. Wee! I have to come back here once just to get the honeycombs and the honeycomb, and that's it. I'm 100%ing this, and I'm gonna 100% every level before I move on to the next one. That's my rule for this game, because you can actually do that. There's no, absolutely no backtracking this. You can actually do this whole game without backtracking. So you don't have to get, like, some move and then come back or something like Banjo Tooie did. But even then, I didn't mind it that much. Just made the game a little longer. Somewhat falsely, but, you know, you get it. All right, let's go back in. Coconuts. Mumble magic strong. The mumble magic strong with this one. Mumble magic strong with this one. Quiet your face. Nope, not high enough. Nope, still not. Got it! That's how you do it, kids. Now you need to complete this guy. Just, you can leave now. Oh, snap! Bitch! Dumb bit! 8 bit! Bit size! 2 bit! Stoop! Yeah, that, that, that's what I meant. Man, I'm really struggling to censor myself. I'm used to not- I'm not used to doing it too much. Hey! Oh. 
Will you? Oh my god, really? Get back here. You know, screw this. That's safe enough to say. So as you open worlds, the enemies from that world can and will escape. And you need to get the talent shot to get up this little hill so we can go even further into Grunt Gruntilda's lair. And you need a certain amount of notes to get through this door. This is a note door, sealed by Grunty with one of her powerful musical spells. Open it up then, Jam Jars. It's not that simple. To open it, you must collect the musical notes from the world. How many do we need? The number on the door is the strength of the spell. The combined total of all your best note scores from the worlds must be at least this to break Grunty's magic. When you open a world door, baddies escape and roam once more. Alright, I'm back. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> and hold my dog on her bed. Or on my bed. She just thinks of hers. That door was easy, you got past. Unfortunately, you're first and last. So you think? Stab it. Yes. Alright, here we go. What's down here? Hello, pot. You've activated a magical cauldron. Find two of the same color to create a shortcut. Uh, I get the bubbly voice. The blub, 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 blub. I gotta keep work on these voices a little bit better, huh? I, it, it's hard to come up with like a bunch of different voices for every single person, but when it comes out of one guy, then again, Mel Blank did it. That man was a dang genius. Love that man. That man was awesome. Hello. Hello there, young ones. I'm Bruntilda. Gruntilda's nice sister. I've crept down here to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets. And I'll tell you three of them every time you find me. Okay, these are actually important because there is a quiz at the end, near the end of this game before the last level where you save Tootie. So paying attention to what she says is important. So let's just get this over with. Grunty brushes her rotten teeth with moldy cheese flavored toothpaste. Yikes. Next. She also washes her hair with rancid milk. Yuck. Yeah, hey, God. Come on. Cheese and milk. And she gets her clothes from the witch's warehouse. That one's not that bad. They only give you three per... Th three per Brentilda. Where am I? Oh, I'm back down. Damn it. I'm so... No! 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 <laughs> like that slide. That slide into first place. Oh, we gotta open this up. I got 11 puzzle pieces. To remove a piece that you have already put down, move the right stick down. But once the picture is complete, all of the pieces are stuck there permanently. Your butt will tell you, and you'll know. But, uh, uh, damn it! I wasn't done speaking yet. How dare you interrupt me? <laughs> no wait, I can actually work that. Hold on. I wasn't done speaking yet, but I'll be full of glee. Your butt I will kick for interrupting me. That yeah, kind of works. Well, that could do much, 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 much better. Activated a mat. Yes, 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 we get it. Just shut, shut, no, shut, no, no. I heard it the first time. No, shut up. Shut up! I love that music that he does in the in Banjo Tooie. That come and have a go. I'll come and have a go if you take your heart in one. Grant Kirkhope, ladies and gentlemen, incredible man. 
dude knew his stuff. Red feathers? I'm gonna grab them right now. Go grab me some red feathers tonight. No! Your jaw is jutting forward and you're uglier than sin. Hey, I'm a red feather. I'll help Kazooie fly when she knows how. I am getting a little tired of all these things. Yeah, I'm just gonna read them out loud. I'm just like, ugh. I'm not giving up on the main characters, but every single thing's a character, and I'm like, ugh. Oh, hi there. This be Treasure Trove Cove. There be two new moves for ye to find. Okay, get this guy now. Because this is why. Shark. Snacker's most tasty dinner. Stay just me. The dang shark is a ah, 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 ah. Mm, lovely. Lovely. Yes. Who be at the door? Yeah. You can interrupt. <laughs> yeah, hey guys, my girlfriend just came in. <laughs> she says hi. <laughs> you didn't hear. Sorry, microphone set low, babe. Oh my goodness, those are delicious. Hey, this Nipper's Beach, you find nothing without Nipper's help. Help us then, crustacean brain. Her cheeky bird need feathers clipping. Oh yeah? Just try it, shellhead. Well, all right, just wait, just wait for it, just wait for it, and smack down! Oh! Wait for it, and smack his face again. One more time. Give me the last jiggy I get, guys. I, gotta, I already gotta cut this episode down by a lot. It's like there's constant noise in the background. Just chaos in this house. I'm gonna stop recording for the night. After this. It's just so much chaos. Right, baby? There's so much going on right now. Yeah, I'm reading every, like, every voice and character. <laughs> ah! Son of a... Dumb crabs. The phone died at 40 pounds. Hmm. I'm gonna keep my, my opinion on iPhones to myself in this. Sucks! Mm, but yeah. <laughs> Android's better! <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. I just got a cough right now. Just, mm. More customizable. More advanced. <coughs> <coughs> you wanna get me one? <coughs> a new one? <coughs> Don't have the money. <coughs> <laughs> uh, what am I gonna call you? Because I don't want to use your real name on this. Like, I'm, you know, like, I just use my, my, my call sign for Air Force in this. So, what, what do you want your name to be? Oh, just Ashley? I'll call you Ash the Dragon. <laughs> just Ash the Dragon. Because I'm Eli the Magical Dragon. Or Eli the Magic Dragon. Magical, either way. And you're, you can be Ash the Dragon. Just more simple. Yeah. You're another dragon! Or no, Ash the Phoenix. How about that? That works out better. Because Phoenix is, phoenixes rise from the ashes. You don't know that? Phoenixes? When they die, they burn, they ignite themselves on fire and they rise from their own ashes. Yeah, they're immortal. They literally, every time they're close to death, they burn up. You saw Harry Potter. Oh, you were probably asleep on that part. <laughs> this chamber of secrets. But yeah, you, you, they, what a phoenix does is it catches, it ignites in glorious flame and then it just, what's left is its ashes and then it gets reborn from it. So they never die. Plus, the phoenix is actually the national animal of Greece. Like, you know, we have the bald eagle, Greece does the phoenix. And the dolphin. They have two. I gotta find look this stuff up, I'm curious. I think Japan has like... No, Japan has one, it's the tanuki. <laughs> China's got a few. I think uh, panda's one. I'm, but I know for sure the dragon is one. This guy's ugly. <laughs> And yeah, look at how gory that is, though. This was a chill. This is a kids' game. E rated E for everyone. Six up. I just shattered the shell man into gory bits. Oh, these guys used to scare me. I should watch this. Hey. <laughs> this is a landmine. Get the mean mugging face and just <laughs> look on your face. Right now. Just... What? <laughs> I'm gonna grab this thing. This this hippo guy, this hippo pirate is crying. Let's see what he wants. 
Hey, hippo pirate man. Oh god, he communicates into- I'm not belching every word of this. Yeah, I can't do it, no. Well, go find it then, blubber butt. Our butt can't swim. Can ye help an old sea hippo? Oh, he lost his gold treasure. Sure, we'll find it for you. Oh, Banjo, you're always so nice. And in we go. Okay. I'm almost done. I'll be done in a second. Ahoy there, I be Blubber's treasure. You be one of two. Ye be one of two. Just one damn jiggy. Just all I need. Just one more jiggy and then I'm done. One more. I got a lot of cut. That's why this episode ran long, guys. There's so much. Like, I even mentioned it to everyone I'm recording and then it's just like, no. We don't care. I need my own place. I need to move out again. I need my family, so... They don't you great. And help them out. No one can interrupt me. Not you guys. I told you. I already told you you could interrupt my pleasure. Welcome you. Alright, I found this dude's treasure. I'm gonna call it a night here. Me treasure. Thank you, me hearties. Take this reward. Hey, another jiggy. I'm off to spin, spin, spin. Oh, I'm gonna actually get to show what happens when you when you quit the game here. If, the, if you get a bad ending when you quit the game every time. Like, if you say exit game here, guys, I'll let you show this to the ending to you. So you know the premise of the story of this, right? Wit, an ugly old fat witch kidnaps your little sister and she's gonna suck the beauty out of her and give it to herself. That's all you need to know. And it's funnier than hell. Because the witch always talks in rhyme. Yeah, I'll show you. Banjo's game ends in my tower. Turn it up, I need full power. <laughs> yes, your quality ship transformation soon be complete. Help me, Banjo. I feel all funny. Baron Bird finished grunting with wind. Yeah, look, this is what happens to her. She's an ugly, fat old witch who turns into this. Oh, look at Grunty. She's beauty. I'm much prettier than Tootie. I don't know why I give him southern accents. Yes, you are my mistress. Grunty, nice. Come back to Mumbo Skull. Yes, you traitor! That's your sister now. That's her sister. Yeah, now. Banjo, your sister wants to have a word with you. No! 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 And she like, starts off like a cute little innocent little bear with pigtails like that. And a little shirt. So, but yeah, that's what the witch did. She turned her drink. She looks like that originally. I know. She goes from young and cute to nasty. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next part playthrough Banjo Kazooie. Eli out! Bye! You say bye. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>